hey y'all welcome back to my channel crystal heart my name is crystal and today we are doing a fabric haul from the craft thrift y'all before we get this video started y'all don't forget to hit that thumbs up y'all don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the little bell to be notified whenever i post a live or a video or whatever else also we have started our facebook group it's called crystal heart create and share i have the link for it in the description box y'all go follow us on um not follow but join the group y'all join the group where we can share our projects i love to see y'all projects because here i can't see it y'all only can see what i'm doing so i would love to see what y'all are doing and then y'all can see what each other is doing so don't forget go down join the facebook group and all the other socials they're down there too y'all do that all right so we just leaving from me and my girls are just leaving from what we call the craft thrift austin creative reuse where we also met one of the subscribers rebecca hey girl so um yeah that was fun that was really fun um found some cool stuff so i'm gonna show you what i found fabric as usual but um yeah so let's get started um these bundles i bought way too many of these bundles these bundles are five dollars and they have strips uh what does it say 25 pieces at least one eighth of a yard each piece is at least one eighth yard so they're kind of just various so i kind of go through as fast as i can because it is a lot but i got all of this for five dollars y'all and i have like four or five more of them so that's why i'm gonna go through quickly so y'all can see but this is a little tag um a lot of moda riley blake this is Lori holt so it's a gray some of these i get because i see a few pieces that i like and then i have some that aren't my favorite but i'll have to find a way to use them or redonate them moda plaid um what is this i don't know wecker fresh old me i don't know some of the salvages you can't really see um what they are come on she's gonna show y'all what she got and cam will as well uh this i don't know what this is crochet draw make create this will be cute on like a little bag or something like a little um project bag i'm done reading a white snowflake a white and a blue snowflake. snowflakes Oh, this is some of the Nantucket Summer, which is probably what caught my eye because I wanted more of the Nantucket Summer fabric. Between that and the Dwell uh, fabric, which is Moda Camille Roskelly, I wanted more of that. Uh, this is this, I don't know. Oh, this one is quite beautiful. Oh, that, one, that one's like a painting. I don't even know Let me what it see. is. That one's like a painting. What it's not a batik because it's white on the back side, but it is um, like a printed, I guess. But it's pretty. Mommy, it's like a watercolor uh, um, painting. Yeah. What is this one? Created by Anya. I don't know. Getaway. Okay, I can look at every single one in great detail, but <laughs> this little blue... It has little um, designs on it. And I don't know, y'all. Today, I was just all about the blues because I want to do... I bought the swoon... Um, the swoon... Look at how beautiful this is. I the bought swoon. the swoon pattern, and I want to do at least one block. And that one block, like, might be... I might make a wall hanging out of it. I'm going to do the whole pattern, but... I want to do one block just to test it out right now. And I want to do it in these blues. I got me some of this. This is the Camille Roskelly. Uh, no. This one, I don't know. It has some... Something was before that one. Oh, I missed one? Yeah. Okay, sorry. Promise me a rose garden, Pet Sloan. Uh, solid. <laughs> and then some of this. I've had a lot of this. I don't remember. What was that? But I've, I had this in different colors, a pink for sure. Okay, so that was one. Five dollars for all of that, y'all. Remember that. Mommy, I'm done reading. Okay, thank you for telling me. 
Can okay. Yes, mommy's recording. Right now. <laughs> Okay. And I'm not editing, editing all this out, so you'll get to see. This is life of the homeschooling family. All yeah. right, so this is another one that was five dollars. Yes, sometimes they're half off at two fifty, but they're, these were all five dollars. Okay, solid, white on white. This is another piece from the Nantucket um, summer, which I have a lot of this already. Not a lot, but I have bigger pieces of this already because I just already did. This little green. This was like a green bunch. I don't know why I felt the need for this green. Solid. Uh, this for sure is Lori Holt because I have some of it already. We have this situation. This one. Oh, this is a a, a tulip pink. I'm getting caught up in my ring. This is a tulip pink. Uh, I don't know what this is. It's some little lobster and fish. Or I'm from Louisiana. I would say that's some little crawfish. <laughs> some more solids. Solids. What am I going to do with all these green solids? I'm not a green person. Make a rainbow. Oh, white on white. Yeah. That might be something fun for you to do, Kim. Uh, this. What is this? O'Reilly Blake Flea Market by Lori Holt. I've never seen this one. I've seen a lot of her uh, flea market, but I haven't seen that one. I have this. I believe this is uh, Riley Blake as well. No, this is Moda. Keep your face toward the sunshine shot. I have some of this at home. It's just a cute polka dot. More honey maple. And then some solids. So $5 for that whole bundle. All right, y'all. Where's my other bag? There's more, y'all. Wait, that's my bag. Oh, more. And there's another bag. So, all right, let's get to the fat quarters and then I'll go back to some more bundles. Um, like I told y'all, the blue had me in a chokehold. I got this. I think this is uh, Dwell. Is it? Yeah, this is Dwell. Another Camille Roskelly. I wanted some, some of this. I wanted this. I wanted the navy blue version of this. But I was excited to find this one. Um, this is also from the Dwell line. I found three fat quarters of it. So I bought all three of those. Um, just, I don't know. Blue had me in a chokehold, y'all. And then this is like a grunge. Uh, a white grunge with gray. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. This is a, I'm pretty sure, AGF or Gallery Fabrics. Uh, Flower Wit. Flower It is the line. It is beautiful. Oh my goodness. I love this. I love it. Um, another blue. I don't know. Indigo Garden. Beautiful. Another random blue. Is it random? This is a Raleigh Blake. And then this, I was just on the blue train today, y'all. This is, what is this? Moda? Um, something gray. I don't know, but this. And then I got a white with a blue polka dot, a navy blue polka dot. And then I remember, and I might be wrong, but I feel like I remember getting this in a box. So I figured now that I'm starting to work on my box and I think I love the mason jar vases that um, if, it, if I did get in a box, I'll be able to use this with that box. But um, it's forget me not. And if I'm wrong about that, then I'll just have some cute jar flower fabric. All right, y'all. This is another bag and you know this is a a reuse store so the bags are just whatever so it's a in a heb bag all right so this is another five dollar bundle it's just this fabric um what is even the name of this collection i let 
is the eyelet um is it moda okay but it's just all the same fabric but i never get big pieces of fabric here and i figured this would be like an awesome background fur quilt so just being able to have so much of it um fig tree are they all the same yeah so it's all the same but it's a bunch for five dollars where are you gonna find this much this is like buying yardage even though it's cut into strips um it'll be good for a background for something oh so while me and rebecca were in there shopping rebecca rent came across these um kits so every now and then i've seen kits in the reuse but today they had some awesome kits now i'm i like the idea of quick kits but i'm not the person that can throw that much money out at one time so i, I usually don't get kits even though i know kits are probably a cheaper option than buying all this random fabric but they had some awesome kits they had the uh bonnie and camille uh, i don't remember the name of it but it was a block of the month and it came with all the fabric they had a uh fig tree and coat oh that one was beautiful it was orange and black which was more like a halloween colors or fall color but just the pattern was beautiful and another one i can't remember rebecca you can comment below but rebecca was able to get those and that was awesome cheapo depot me i bought the little basic tiny kit for 12 dollars because <laughs> i just have a hard time spending a lot of money at one time so i'm gonna go ahead and open this up because i haven't opened it myself and me and rebecca were kind of wondering why they had some embroidery floss in there so i'm gonna open it up if i can get the tape off these people take crazy i don't know if i can get the tape off without scissors Oh, I bust up the bag. Well, it's open now. Okay, so it came with some DM DMC floss. Not sure why. It's the daisies and butterflies. I think this is a cute kit for a baby. Um, I don't know any babies being born, but you know, they're always being born, so that's that. Uh and it comes with the backing. I assume that's the backing, or maybe it's I assume it's the backing comes with a mini charm pack a charm pack uh some of this fabric and then this fabric looking at the quilt it comes with everything this is the binding so maybe this will introduce me to the to the kit world by having just a tiny kit with everything because even though i buy boxes they don't come with um the finishing kit all right, y'all, they got people driving about. Anyway, this video may be longer than I thought it was gonna be. So, that whole little kit for $12, cool. So, like I said, maybe it'll introduce me into the kid world and I'll like having everything just there for me and maybe I can do kits in the future. Okay, another $5 bundle. Y'all know I'm scrappy, I'm scrappy blue i couldn't help myself so i have this floral this what is this i don't know but it's beautiful it's different um regular hospital blue a little of that blue are the kids getting off of school or something okay a little yeah small fabric a little small floral a little polka dot from who is this from lella boutique i think it's from flower pot line this one is cute is this lori holt yeah farm girl vintage this blue this i believe comes from the nantucket summer line i have some of that already 
this is cute. This is a cute, um, it's like lavender, little polka dot. Is this in the Nantucket summer? Because I feel like I have some of this. I think it is. It's not my favorite, but I think I have some. I have so much in this, uh, these little X's in different colors. I love it though. I love this fabric as like a, a solid, a basic without being a complete solid. I have some of this too. I don't remember what it is though. Um, a little gingham action. This motor. This. Some solids. I'm hitting my ceiling. Solids of some more hospital blue. What is this? I don't know, but I like it. This. I, I like this. Oddly enough, I like this. Because this is usually not my style. Uh, Betsy something from Moda. I don't know. Oddly enough, I like it. This blue situation. And then a solid y'all another bundle of blue i couldn't help myself all right and this is my last bundle y'all so just stick with me stick with me till the end so this is some sort of polka dot not sure about it this looks like a lori hulk but not sure this blue um, I feel like I've seen this one. This is Nantucket Summer. I already know. Nantucket Summer. I think that's why I bought this bundle. Because it had a lot of Nantucket Summer. So that I can match it up with the one that I already have more than Nantucket. Yeah, this. Um, this is Moda. I don't know what collection. I can't see. The fussies are in my nose. Threads That Bind by Blackbird Designs. And this is like a white, I guess. This is all na also Nantucket Summer. And this um, Wyndham Fabrics is like spark plugs. This is a Riley Blake, uh, Lori Holt, I believe. I don't know what this is, but it's cute. It reminds me of my childhood bedspread. Blue. Blue. A little gingham. The people are probably passing by thinking I'm so weird with all this fabric. Uh, this blue, it is, I don't know, remembering the sweet, simple things of, I think it's Lori Holt. Another random blue. This is uh, another Riley Blake. This one is cute. Riley Blake. And then Nan took it summer. And then a random blue black batik in there. Okay, so that is whoop, all the fabric. I think I was able to get a few like um, thread keepers, uh, floss keepers, and there was sadly only one DMC that I picked up. Ten cents for the DMC. Three, uh, the floss keepers are 25 cents for the pack. I think I bought a few packs. Now, uh, yeah, Kamani wants to show what she got. Cameron, you want to show what you got? No. No. Well, Cameron bought some beads. She does a lot of bracelets and beads. She bought beads, insisting on getting this um, to clean the whiteboard at home. And this, what is this? Uh, acrylic paint in some weird yellow color but oh and she bought some of these little tiles are like 10 cents for some like wooden uh sampler pieces that they paint on but it's 10 cents what is this called uh, uh fabric scrap did i buy no i didn't buy any scraps you didn't buy no scrap packs. i usually buy scrap packs the I got scrap, a scrap pack scrap packs are a dollar so um, they're perfect for her to do little small projects or for anybody to do little small projects. And she, they're usually like little fun fabrics. I got this color. Uh, look I like. shows out the scrap pads because she was picking up some other colors. Oh no. So Looks weird. like she one. had her mind on blue too. And 
then all right what else you got booby okay. I, I got this one. fabric okay she got some tink tinkerbell fabric so. and it is a half yard for a dollar fifty all their half yard cuts are a dollar fifty look how cute it is and so then cute. i got another scrap pack. another scrap pack for a dollar so cute a white one this one um, I forgot. I don't know what this is called. I don't know. It's like some little fans. Uh, I don't know. Cow print. Cow print. This pink thing. And then all the sewing things. Oh, yeah. A little sewing machine. A little form. Dress form. I want to be an artist. So, this. Uh, it's a pink pin. It's and like a Posca marker. Yeah, they bought, they bought another one, apparently, of that, too. Yeah, but it doesn't like shake like this noise. So the whole haul, including Cam's beads, all my fabric, not including her fabric because she paid for it herself, was $56, y'all. $56 for all of that. That's crazy. Like, I usually don't spend this much money at the Craft Earth. Usually I keep it at $20 or below, but I went kind of crazy on the um on the bun on the five dollar bundle so it added up but fifty six dollars for all of that come on now anyway um yeah so that's about it like i said before y'all don't forget to hit the like button y'all don't forget to subscribe also if you're still watching and you haven't clicked down below to go to the facebook group go to the facebook group and join the facebook group it'll be so much fun and we're just trying to build it right now um I just started with like yesterday or day before so anyway um that's all i have for you guys so i'll see you next time bye come on child <laughs> bye, bye.